How are we doing guys? Reese here, back with another video. Uh, I've got a really interesting one for you today. If you are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, click the bell notification. Um, today's stock is an EV play. It's a penny stock. Um, I think you're going to like this one. Uh, the, the ticker is BUSXF. Uh, they've got a couple of other tickers as well. I'm sure you can Google it. Um, the, the one on 212 that I'm buying, I'm trading 212, is BUSXF. Uh, Grande West Transportation is the name of the company. Uh, the price at the minute is around two and a half dollars. Uh, market cap's two hundred and fifty-six million, uh, and debt to assets for two thousand nineteen was fifty-five percent. We'll get into why that is in a minute. Uh, so this one was researched by myself and the members of um, my Discord for the Patreon um, Patreon uh, patrons. Uh, so we did this a collaboration for this one. Uh, we all did our part. So I'm going to tell you about, a bit about the company, see what you think. Um, so it's a Canadian EV bus company. Um, it, it trades on the OTC markets as well. Uh, but I've got some really something really big news at the end as well. So uh, stay tuned for that. Um, so the summary of the company, I'll just read it out for you. Uh, yeah, so the other tickers is, is uh, on the T TSXV, it's BUS, just bus. Uh, um, there's a European one as well it's a three digits I can't remember what it is um, let me just find it uh, yeah so Grande West Transportation is a Canadian company that designs and engineers mid-size multi-purpose transit vehicles for public and commercial enterprises Grande West utilizes world-class manufacturing partners to produce the best in-class heavy duty vicinity bus now this bus looks absolutely beautiful I've got to say well as beautiful as a bus can look, but it does look cool. It looks good. It looks nice. It's, it looks uh, really decent. You have to check. I'll, I'll try and remember to put a link in the description for, um, if not, it's just grandwest.com. So, um, on to press releases. We've got, uh, on the 4th of January, just over a week ago, I'll read this one out to you. It's, it's quite a good one. Um, Grande West, a Canadian manufacturer of mid-sized multi-purpose transit vehicles for sale in Canada and the United States, is reporting on current deliveries for the fourth quarter of 2020 and early first quarter of 2021. In the third quarter, management discussions and analysis, the company promised to provide a corporate update on expected deliveries as previously disclosed. The company has orders to deliver over 40 million before the second half of 2021, which is, you know, nice. Um, this is a very positive step towards regaining profitability and increased liquidity after the negative results of the pandemic. The work of an effective, uh, I will get into that. Um, the company has st started delivery of a large order of over 90 buses. The original target set in summer uh, of 2020 was to deliver these buses before year end. Approximately 75% of these buses are in the process of being delivered, but the vast majority will be delivered in the first quarter of 2021 due to covid related slowdowns at the manufacturing plant and difficulty securing transportation for the buses. Uh, the remaining 25% of this order will also be delivered during the first quarter of 2021. All other orders expected for delivery before the end, the second before the second half of 2021 are on track. So, you know, if you double that up, that's 80 million. The market cap's 200, what was it, 256. Seems a little bit undervalued to me, and obviously the more orders are going to come in. They're having the best quarter at the minute. I, I won't, I won't go too much into it. Um, uh, there was something else I wanted to point out. I'll just find for you. Um, no, uh, there was. I think there was something else. I think they're building a new factory in, in the states. Yeah, I think they are. Um, to obviously that'll be another good thing, and maybe why they've got so much debt. You have to double check that one because I forgot to write that down. Uh, I'm maybe getting confused. So yeah, um, moving on. It's a, it's within a trending industry. Trending industry. Um, it's Biden policies are going to help this this company. Obviously, um, there's they're aiming um, to get on the Nasdaq. By the way, they're aiming to uplist to the Nasdaq between March and May. That's massive in itself. Um, we like uplistings, don't we? So the, produ the producing now, there's already vehicles on the road. That's uh, that's already happened. The buses do look great, like I say. Um, it's continued an uptrend, an uptrend for quite a while. 
Uh, but I think it's got a lot of room to run for the whole of 2021. Um, so yeah, it's a similar play for me to Pro Terra and Green Power Motors. Um, you know, in the bus, in the bus thing, the EV bus thing. Um, so if you missed out on Pro Terra, this might be the next best thing for you. It might be even better. Um, you know, for your investment. Um, aiming towards up, up, let's like say between March and May. Easily a five to ten bagger in my opinion. Do your own research on that though. Um, so yeah, I watched a, an interview today, actually only a few hours ago on Rich TV Live. Um, so this interview is with the CEO, uh, William Trainer, uh, who, who, who stated that he's an accumulator of the stock, not a seller. Um, a little bit of information from that. Um, it's focused on bringing institutional investment into their company, uh, which is always is obviously good for any investor. Um, the well positioned for growth was one of his quotes. He says there's new news releases to come. Uh, he says that the EV trend is going to really help them. Nine um, percent of buses in Canada are sold in Canada, and ten percent of the buses are sold in the US at present. That's obviously they're looking to aim to get more into the the American market. Um, and he also said that the European market could be something for the future, which would be also massive. Um, he also said pretty, he's pretty sure that institutions have started to take positions, although he, he can't say for sure at this time. Um, but yeah, you need to go and check out um, the website. It's uh, the, the bus doesn't look, look nice, like I say. There's loads of press releases you can go through. Um, and yeah, I mean, if this goes up to NASDAQ in March, May, between March and May, we're looking at a five ten bagger easily here. Um, so I, I took a position in this today. Uh, I am looking to buy more if I get the opportunity to average down. Uh, I think I'm in about two forty something. So yeah, let me know what you think of the uh, of, of the company. Um, if I've missed anything, please make sure you tell us in the comments. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. If you liked the video, leave a thumbs up. If you didn't, leave a thumbs down. But just tell us why, uh, so we can improve in the future. Uh, like I say, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe, click the bell, not, uh, bell for notifications, um, follow us on Twitter, uh, stop twits, or in the description, and if you're not in the uh, the Discord group yet, if you sign up to Patreon, it's £4.50 a month, you get to come into the group, we talk about these things before they even come out, as I say, this video was researched by the group uh, in general, there's a good few of us on this, um, so yeah, come and get involved, um, we've got over 100 people in there now, so it's going really well. Uh, thanks for watching the video guys and I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers